Good morning. Well, it's morning for me. It's early morning. It's like six in the morning, which is too early for me, but that's another story. <laughs> this is my race day vlog. I am going to be running my first half marathon in about an hour and a half. I've got my race day shirt, my number 31. Happy trails running. Um, it says like Jordan River half marathon on the back, something like that. Um, I'm nervous. <laughs> I have taped my foot. I have used um, gold bond friction defense on areas that are prone to chafing and I will actually even be bringing it with me in my running belt so that I can reapply as necessary. Um, yeah, I'm nervous. Just, just nervous. <laughs> okay, the race starts in just a couple minutes. I'm standing towards the back because I'm slow. But I'm really excited and nervous and excited. Popping in after the race, apparently my, um, <clears throat> one mile check-in did not record. Um, basically, at one mile I was going faster than I anticipated, but I was feeling strong, feeling great, and um, enjoying myself. Two mile check-in. Still feeling good. Still going a little faster than I thought. So a little bit about this mar half marathon. It is a small event. There's only 300 participants. Um, and it follows a paved trail that um, just follows the Jordan River. This is actually the same trail that I tend to run on when I don't go to the park to run. It's just farther south. And because this event is so small, and because I'm so slow, um, I am not surrounded by other runners, so it it basically is like just another one of my tr training runs, just longer and faster, and there's a medal at the end, and pumpkin bread. The sun has come up over the mountains. Oh, this is so pretty. I'm walking, but just for a few seconds so that I can get good um, footage, but yeah, so nice. Three miles, only a little more than 10 left to go. The temperature is beautiful today. Um, when I got to the start, it was upper 40s, maybe low 50s. It was chilly, very cold. But, um, it shouldn't get above 70s throughout the whole race. Um, it's probably about mid-50s right now. But running, that makes it feel great. Still going strong, I think. My foot has been tinging a little bit, tinging, twinging. Niggling, I don't know, but it's okay. No more than it has been during training runs, so still doing good. Four miles in, still feeling really good. Um, I don't know if I've talked about what my goals for this race are. Main goal, finish, you know, just, Cross the finish line, doesn't matter when. Um, slightly more lofty goal, but hopefully achievable. Finish in under 315, because that would mean marathon pace for the marathon I'm doing in April. Super lofty goal, that would be totally awesome, but I don't know if I can do it under three hours. We'll see what happens. Five miles. 
I have started passing the fast runners who are already on their way back to the finish line because they are fast and I'm not. So I know for a fact that I'm not the last person. I know there are people behind me. I also know for a fact there are not very many people behind me because I'm slow. Have I mentioned that? I think I've slowed down a bit from the first few miles, but still going strong. Just my breathing is a little more labored, obviously. Look at this, is so pretty. I just went up a big hill. Now I get to go down the other side. It's so pretty. Six miles in. That's about 10K right there. Still not halfway done yet. Still going strong, still going slow. Because you can be strong and slow at the same time. Seven miles in. Really struggling. I feel good, I'm just tired. And definitely slower than before. But I have passed the halfway point, so that's awesome. I'm tired. Eight miles in. My foot's bothering me a bit, but it's not really affecting my running form, so that's fine. Still tired, still winded, still slow, but still going. Nine miles. That big hill that I went over on the way out, I ran all the way up it on the way out, but I only ran halfway up it on the way back. I sort of power hiked the second half because it was steep and my legs are tired. 10 miles. This is the farthest I've ever run. 5k left. Slow and steady and super tired. 11 miles. This is the distance I should have run at the end of week 10 if I hadn't hurt my foot. Slow and steady, plodding along one foot at a time. Twelve miles. I feel like I'm gonna throw up. I have to poop. My fingers are swollen. I'm exhausted. Everything hurts and I'm dying. Walking break. My body's doing this weird thing where I'm... Sorry. Where I'm like listing to the left. Like I'm uh, leaning to the left and... It's weird. I'm so tired. I just want to be done. I have less than a mile left. I just want to be done. What the heck was I thinking? Signing up for a half marathon. Oh, there we go again. I'm tilting. Ah. Oh, that's weird. Coming up on the finish line. I was gonna do a sprint finish, but I don't think I can. I'll just keep going until I'm done. about 13 minutes and 6 seconds. 
My hands are very shaky. Um, the camera is probably going to stabilize this quite a bit. Oh, my daughter is holding the phone for me. <laughs> I'm holding it still. But, um, oh, my hands are so shaky. Uh, my average pace was about 14, 20 something. So I did achieve my um, my secondary goal. So my first goal was finish, and I, I achieved that. Second goal was finish in under 3:15, and I did that. I did not finish in under three hours, and that's fine. Um, oh gosh, I'm soaked. So I, I'm still kind of leaning to the left, not quite as much because I'm I'm sitting at a table and I'm like leaning on the table. But uh, so once I got to the finish, I pretty much just had to sit down at the side of the the trail and um, and then I was still leaning, so I had to lay down for a while. And, and I had a cinnamon roll and I had pumpkin chocolate chip bread. And I've had like three servings of Gatorade. Cinnamon roll. I did it. I'm so proud of myself. My feet hurt. Cinnamon roll frosting on my face. So yeah, that is, oh, and here, here's my metal. <laughs> so shaky, I'm so shaky that, ugh. Jordan River Half Marathon 2022. It's, it's made of wood, really cool. No, it's made of wood. Yes, made of wood. And that is my first half marathon. I have to drive home. That's gonna be hard. <laughs> it's like a 20 minute drive. Oh well. If I can run 13.1 miles, I can. drive it while you're in the car? I don't think Zaley wants to drive for 20 minutes. Anyway. Okay, that ends this vlog. And in a few months, like, hang on. In seven months, I'll be running twice this distance. Yay! Okay. There's just like ice cubes and grass over there just popping in real quick to give my actual finish time. It was not 13 minutes and six seconds. <laughs> my brain was not functioning properly at that time. Um, my finish time was three hours and six minutes. Okay, now it's the end of the vlog.